event with very important children here in Loudoun County, Virginia. We are here with the Junior Draft Picks Foundation to celebrate the three F's, fun, food, and friends. These kids are here not because they're special needs, but because they're very special and they've come out to have a great time. We want to invite you to come out on June 14th to the Adelie Park in Leesburg, Virginia to celebrate this event with Denise and Lamar Marshall. <laughs> with the Junior Draft Picks, and I've got Denicia Marshall and Lenny Godfrey, a celebrity in her own right, who's come out today to support the Junior Draft Picks. Lenny, tell us what this organization means to you. It's absolutely a dear organization to me. You know, Denicia's son, Zeeland, is so wonderful, and so many children in this area who have special needs really don't have the opportunity to get out and have attention paid to them. So Denicia has created this so that children can really enjoy themselves, and I am here to support it, and a benefactor, I want to thank you very much. <laughs> I had a feeling I was going to get that from you, and I'm thankful for it. I'm so happy you're here today. Now tell us a little bit about the relationship here and how that uh, applies to junior draft picks. Oh, wow. It's like having a second mother there to, to boss me around, but she <laughs> makes sure that everything that is going on with the foundation is running smoothly and, you know, keeps me and Lamar on target at all times. So this is our this is our other CEO of the company. You have a celebrity CEO slash mom who's in charge of the junior draft pick. I'm there to just kind of keep them all in line, you know, to make sure everything is going well and you know, every once in a while. I might need that also. All right, I thank you for watching today, and we have been so fortunate to be here with such special children. They're not just special needs children, they are special children, and we're thankful to be a part of it today. Thank you so much. And we're back with Denicia Marshall and the Junior Draft Picks. Denicia, tell us about the organization and what it means to you and your husband. It's it's a, a heartfelt mission, first of all, because of our son, Zeeland, who is autistic. And, you know, we wanted to bring something here to Virginia where our kids can get out and do things with, you know, the general public and not be pushed back. So, you know, like I said, it's very heartfelt. We see these kids and it, they're a joy. You know, and other people to us don't experience that. And we want to get the public out to interact with these kids so they'll know, you know, they want to play, they want to be loved, they want to interact, they want to do everything that we do. You can go to juniordraftpicks.com and pull up all the information that you need to find out about the events. And it has a registration, donation, everything, you'll find it there. I thank Denise here for being here with us today, and I'm so happy to be at Bowl of America with the VIPs. We'll be right back with Lamar. We're here with the NFL's Lamar Marshall, a rack em and sack em type of linebacker who has put this organization together out of the kindness of his heart and out of the passion of his heart. Lamar, can you tell us a little bit more about this organization? Well, we started working with the kids with uh, special needs and autism. And what we do, we just work with their gross and motor skills and just try to help them out, move them around, work with their coordination and things of that nature. And um, we decided to not only do things inside the Loudoun County Public Schools, but to also work outside of the county schools and give these, these kids something to do physically, but at the same time have fun. 
All right, that sounds terrific to me. Lamar, tell us a little bit about what the up and coming activities are for the foundation. Well, we have a festival June 14th at Ida Lee Park, and that's just going to be a fun day for the kids. They get to ride on rides, pet ponies, ride on ponies, and do other things, <laughs> little clowns and balloons and other amazing things. <laughs> It sounds fun. Now, what time does the activity start, and um, what can people do to help the, the foundation? Well, the it starts at 12 p.m. for the, uh, the doors open up 12 p.m. for the all special need kids, and then for the general public, it's op it opens up at 1 p.m. So it goes from 12 p.m. to 5 p.m. So there'll be other vendors as well, and for people who want to support, uh, we have a website www.juniordraftpicks.com. That's J R draft picks like the number one draft pick that I wasn't <laughs> but uh, but but yeah so that's basically okay. the date. Yeah. Now let me ask you this what is the foundation in most need of right now like what do you guys need now do you need money do you need volunteers tell it tell us what you need well first we like to do everything we try to do we do free for the special need kids but with that we do incur expenses as well so you know, we're more than welcome to uh, have people donate money or, you know, I'm, I'm the type of person, money is good, but sometimes your time is a lot more. So uh, if we got both, that's great too. All right, excellent. So the way that they can get in contact with the foundation is www.juniordraftpicks, that's J-R-draftpicks.com. Excellent, excellent. So we look forward to the event. It is June 14th. June 14th. June 14th. I expect all of you to come out and celebrate and support Junior Draft Picks. We're going to be right back with Denicia and their very special son, Zeeland. Did I get it right? Zeeland, like New Zealand. He's our VIP of the day. We got the entire Marshall family, and I want you to introduce everyone for me, okay? Okay. This is Zeeland. Hi, Zeeland. Hey, hi. This is Taylor right here, down here. Hi. hi. And this is Milan. Hi. <laughs> Zeeland is our VIP today, right? Yes. Okay, and tell us a little bit about how he affected this organization, like how he was the, the premier reason that you guys started this organization. I mean, basically, um, Zeeland is autistic, and we don't see that as a handicap. We see it as something that it may take him a little longer to catch on to things, but he'll get it. Right. And so we wanted to, you know, give that to the other kids, let everyone know that it's not a handicap in our eyes. It's an attribute. Absolutely. Absolutely. Because I noticed earlier, he, Zeeland and I were on the same page earlier. When I hear music, I want to dance. And he was dancing. And I was like, okay, you know what? I think that he is more free than the rest of us because he's not bound by the social mores. And I don't even know that we want to do that to because, you know, I have a special needs son as well. And I don't know if we want to contain them and take that freedom away from them. No, absolutely. I have, you know, I always say this to people about the Bible. There's a scripture that says, be careful who you entertain, for you may be entertaining an angel unaware. And when you have these special needs kids, they don't know what it is to be intentionally mean or to hate or to just, you know, be racist or to push you aside. They love on everybody. And I feel like these are the angels that we are seeing on earth because they are so pure. I know, that's right. Uh, Lamar, give us your comments and tell us your thoughts around your family and your special son and this special organization. Well, you know, just watching him develop and watching him grow, uh, you see the changes, you see, as, you know, you always want to do as much as you can for your son and your daughters or whatnot. And I just try to push him to his limit, you know, because we don't accept anything. You know, we, we always pray for him and we just want the best for him. And that's why we want to provide as much as we can for him as well as my family and as well as other families. So I think the lesson to take away from this is we should all try to be more like Zeeland. Yes. Thank you so much for watching today, and we'll see you next time. More importantly, we'll see you on June 14th. June 14th. Idaly Park in Leesburg, Virginia at 12 o'clock. Yes. All right, thank you so much for being with us today, and have a good day. Ooh, motivation. She's my motivation.